Spaghetti. Spaghetti. Crew legit. Welcome back, viewers. Josh here. Neil here. And we're playing Castlevania 1. Woo! One so of, amazing. Go one ahead. of the best games ever. Straight up. Hard as a son of a bitch. Yeah. Spawned how many sequels? Uh, 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 yeah, I lost track a long time ago. <laughs> Nintendo 64 games, Super Nintendo games, Sega yeah, games. Yeah, the Nintendo 64 games don't count. <laughs> yeah, I, I'm, a, I'm with you there. The, uh... Well, they were terrible. I mean, really? Just straight up. They, did they actually release a second one, or was it just the one? There was a second one, and it was just as bad as the first. Now, I heard, and I don't know if this is true, that a, the original game was supposed to have four players. Yeah, and, you know, you were supposed to be able to play, like, a Frankenstein monster-type monster. Type monster. Uh, there was, like, a werewolf that you were supposed to be able to play. Uh... Yeah, yeah, I do yeah. remember there being four characters. Um, uh, the that, traditional Belmont. Yeah, uh, there was the little girl who uh, used magic. the ch chakra. She had like a throwing weapon thing, right? I and, think. And magic. Yeah. Yeah, and uh, I don't know, they all played a little differently, but it didn't really seem to help the gameplay at all. Yeah. Really stiff, bad camera angles. <laughs> And in the second one, at the very least, I don't remember the first one too well, but the second one didn't even have music. Really? There was no music at all. It was just game sounds. It, it was probably the most boring experience I can think of. Oh, wow. That's that's really weird. Yeah, coming from Konami, it was just a big surprise. I, oh, I missed it. That wasn't what you'd expect from a company like this, you know? I mean, they make amazing games, but... Uh, those weren't one of Come the, on. two of them. <laughs> maybe, maybe it was, like, rushed? Yeah, it could have been. Just to get something out on the Nintendo 64 for them. Fine, I'm not going to take the... Sh no, I want to take the shortcut. You're going to get hit by the bat and knocked up? Yeah. Do it. Ah! Ah, ah, ah. No, okay, I'm not going to take the shortcut. going to spend half the review just watching. <laughs> yeah, I'm going to try... I'm going to do it! <laughs> I can do it! This oh. is one part. I'm gonna try it 50 bajillion times. Whoa, fish men spitting fireballs. They be spitting Short. fire, yo! They're spitting hot flame. You're gonna get burned, Simon. <laughs> no, I'm not! <laughs> In your face, fish man. <laughs> you have so, a nice pretty stopwatch, too. Yeah, I gotta get rid of that and get an axe. Ooh. Oh. So we've we've watched a speed run for this. We haven't watched it recently. It's probably been like uh, at least a month. Yeah. So I'm gonna try some of the speed run tricks as we play through, and hope they work. Yeah, I'm gonna get the axe just in case. <laughs> oh, all right. There's this big ugly bat. Do it. And ah, oh. mm, is that not no? What in the heck? No. Sure, figures. Try and watch it. No problem. Yeah. Try and do it. No. Yeah. And I bet you anything, if we were recording this right now, it would have worked perfectly. Yeah, if we weren't recording. I did this like 10 times off camera. Yeah. <laughs> 20 <laughs> times, actually. Yeah. Nope, you try and show somebody something and you fall flat on your face. That's, yeah. You know. <clears throat> it's the way the world works. Yep. Murphy, you son of a bitch! <laughs> I guess we'll hand off. You want to hand off on death or on levels? Oh, uh, on death. Yeah, okay, that works cool. for me. Well, uh, prepare to never play because <laughs> I beat this game like 87 times in the last 20 minutes. <laughs> Damn, that yeah. should be a speedrun record right yeah, there. It is. You know, I just wasn't recording because, you know, I'm not that type of person. <laughs> Obviously. Obviously. <laughs> As we record this, you know, I'm just not that kind of guy. No. Oh, man. Now, I can't say I've been too horribly far in this game. I've been a ways in, but uh, I was never that great at it. I kind of get my ass kicked after a while. Ah! No! <laughs> Chucking giant crosses like boomerangs. 
Yeah, Konami Cross in the house. Yeah. Always seems to be the best weapon in any Konami game. Yeah, apparently. <laughs> oh. Anti-human theme, though. Always. Hey, look! Are you yeah. human? You're gonna get eaten by monsters! Yeah, were there any other horror game series really... Uh, oh, no! Uh, the crappy dagger. Fail. Any other horror game series on the... Uh, on the, the NES, um, I mean, there were there were other horror games. I mean, you could you could say Contra was a horror game series, but that was also Konami. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah, there was. Oh, uh, there's Nightmare on Elm Street. That was. Oh no! <laughs> How did I not get hit by those Medusas? I was trying to get hit by them. <laughs> but yeah, Nightmare on Elm Street. Yeah. Um, there was the uh, Friday the Thirteenth game. Yeah. That was a pretty good game, actually. A lot of people hated it, but uh, I enjoyed it. Well, uh, I, I can understand why, because it had a lot of confusing parts and... Yeah, navigating the world was just a little brutal. Yeah. <laughs> oh, I'm going to the right, and you go left on the map. Wait a minute. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I think I figured that one out. I always told people, watch behind you. Check out the lake. If you can see the oh, lake yeah, behind yeah. you. Oh, yeah, yeah. I remember... <laughs> well, that was easy. That was simple, yeah. Yeah, I remember when playing it, you want to pay attention to the position of the lake. Yeah. I kind of like things like that. You know, they're like, they're not just holding your hand. you got to really pay attention to what's going on and figure it out. Yeah, and it made sense since you were going around the lake. Yeah. It did make sense. It was just, you know, a pain in the ass to navigate. Especially when you're trying to save some kids before they die. Yeah. Uh-oh, Jason's coming. Which way am I going? Yeah, exactly. Oh. Yeah, that was a good game. Um, let's see. There's the infamous Dr. Jekyll and Mr. Hyde. I don't know if you could so call that a horror game. Come on! Game. Oh. Uh, was, you know, a horror story, essentially, but it wasn't really so much a horror game. It's just a really brutal, frustrating... Yeah. Oh, there you go. You go. <laughs> <laughs> Lucky! <laughs> Noobing it up, grabbing the dagger. Oh. But yeah, other than that, I mean... Yeah, there were anything? three three consecutive Castlevania games yep. on the SNES. In North America, I don't know if there were actually more in Japan. Ooh, that's a good question. Someone should look that up. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Not right now, though. Not me, because I'm dying! Freaking Medusa heads. All right. Yeah, definitely Medusa heads are... Uh, they carried over and they didn't change at all. Nope, still that same yeah. wavy pattern. <laughs> For sure. I uh, I saw the nerd video where he reviewed the uh, one of the Castlevania games, and I couldn't agree with him more. Every time I see wavy lines, I get pissed off. Yeah. <laughs> Pretty much because of those Medusa heads. <laughs> yeah. Fuck wavy lines. Fuck Medusa heads. Oh. Oh, man. All right. I'm getting somewhere. Yay. Yeah. yeah. Make it to the boss with two health, probably. What's the, bo the boss? Medusa, right? Oh, good lord, is it? Yeah. I'm so screwed. I think you need the... Well, the cross makes it easier. Oh, hey! <laughs> and now I can't get back up there! Yay! You're welcome! <laughs> yep. Wow. Oh. Woo! Spiky evil. Oh, what? <laughs> wow, okay then. Well then, I guess we'll just be continuing. <laughs> Yeah, it's uh, been a while and it shows for me. <laughs> me too. Oh, definitely uh, a little easier than the last game we were playing, though. <laughs> oh, I don't even want to. <laughs> don't even want to go there. But don't. Let's not even talk about it. All right. If you watch, if you've watched the videos, you know what game we're talking about. Yeah, we don't even have to say the name. You'll know. Yeah, also a Konami game. Yeah, Konami. Jeez, it's like they had a monopoly on good, but psychotically difficult video games. Yeah. Which is, it's good. I mean, you gotta respect that they're not copping out and making easier games. Yeah. Come on. Saint No Sesame Street says. Yeah. Definitely. Although one has to wonder if it was just because they wanted to make a difficult game or if they were artificially trying to inflate the time it would take to beat the game. Yeah, because speedruns of this game, you're looking at like 12 minutes. Oh yeah, that's yeah. on the super, super fast end. 
Most people probably wind up around 19 minutes on a really good run. Yeah, we'll be like 17 or 18 episodes probably (laughs) at the rate we're going. Aw, yeah. Uh, I don't want to get a dagger. Ah, yes. Yes. Screw that dagger. Let it rot. Yes. (laughs) Oh, you'd think a direct fire weapon would be welcome here, but no. No. You'd rather have the shit that arcs or takes time. Well, the the problem with the dagger is it doesn't actually go through walls either. That's so true. it's like an inferior version of the cross. Yeah. <laughs> cross burns through everything. Yeah. You... Oh. What? Yay! Yeah! That was helpful. That, that was on purpose, too. Oh. Totally. <laughs> yeah. Fancy. I, uh, yeah. <laughs> MLG Pro. Oh, 360 no scope. 360 <laughs> Guns. That's what this game needed. Guns. Yeah. Oh, you missed the turkey too. Oh well. Uh, yeah. Well, Not that it matters. I got us to this continue point at least, right? Yeah. <laughs> as far as I got before I sat there and got crushed. Oh no. Uh, oh hey, yeah. All right. Oh, this these blah, at least this game has some mercy on you. This is where the stage starts, so this is where you restart. Yeah. But and every time you get to a new stage in the level, you actually you actually restart. And then your continue point is, of course, from after the boss. Oh, phew. Okay. This ought to be a lot easier. Oh, my God! Yes! Explode everything on the screen. Okay. Check the wall. Check the wall. <laughs> no, Always no. check the wall. <laughs> yeah, wall roasts. <laughs> Mm, would turkey. you would you do it? Would you eat a roast? You know, if I was fighting zombies. <laughs> okay, and... <laughs> okay, fair enough. Either I'm gonna no, die from this. Normal or die... circumstances, no. <laughs> if you're in Dracula's castle and you're fighting hordes of the undead with a whip, yes. Okay, good answer. That's the best answer I've heard. I think dying from salmonella or dysentery or something would probably be better than being ripped apart by ghosts and. <laughs> yeah. Okay, I I have a question for you, Neil. Yeah. You, do you want to take a bullshit personality test? Sure. Okay, here's here's the question for you. And there, there will be stipulations. Okay. If you had to go for the rest of your life with either... Never ever being able to wear shoes again. Or not being able to wear any clothes except underwear. Which would you choose? Oh, never... Wait, never no. being able to wear shoes? Yeah. Or or just underwear? Yeah. Uh, and it, if it was cold out, I would say you would be able to wrap yourself up in, like, a blanket or something. <laughs> but no actual clothing. No actual clothing. <laughs> but as soon as you get indoors, you have to remove the blanket. You know, I think I'd keep my shoes. Keep the shoes? Well, God only knows what's out there when you're walking around the yeah. streets. Don't want to be stepping on dirty needles and crap. Yeah. Dirty needles, and because every every street corner has got a dirty needle, <laughs> waiting to infect you with like AIDS or hepatitis or something like that. <laughs> yep, that right. You're addicted to cocaine. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah. I I could live without clothes. I mean, you get bloody cold, but I'm not really bashful. I don't care. There we go. Good answer. Everyone has bits. <laughs> Everyone has bits. Words of wisdom from Neil. <laughs> yeah. I don't know how wise they are, but that works. What about you? Um, I don't know. It's a tough one. Yeah, that is a tough one. I guess we'll have to find out next time. To be continued. Children of the night. What music they make. (laughs)